What's going on everyone out there? It is your splendid host with the most here. It is Team Rai. How are you doing on this spectacular Friday's edition? I am doing wonderful. Peeps, I have social media accounts, but don't worry. I'll discuss that later on in the video. So sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some to drink, or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions, on this very interesting subject. And of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. This one, there will be an article. Okay, now everyone is aware that tonight is Edge's last match in this company. Plus, it's part of his current contract. He's going to face Sheamus on a random SmackDown edition. Now, I know a lot of you are disappointed because it's just a random episode of SmackDown. I think he should have it on a pay per view to close out his story, you know, his chapter. Maybe he will have another match, but this is end of the line for him. Not in a bad way, in a good way. He could spend more time with his beautiful wife, his kids, and other non-activities, you know. This guy is a living legend. He's a Hall of Famer. No one thought he will come out of retirement and beat the odds. And he proved everyone wrong, even the doctors, okay. Too bad he never won a championship, but... That was part of his deal, his contract. If I come back, I don't want to become champion. And he did it. He honored it. You know, he don't need any championship, especially his late in his career, okay? So, he never fought, sorry, he never faced Sheamus 1-1 before. They duked it out as a tag team, you know, like, on the other side, but he never fought him one-on-one. -on -one. So, most likely, we all know who's going to win this match tonight, is um, Edge. Hopefully, it's going to be a clean victory, and hopefully, it'll close out the show. It makes perfectly sense. It's his home turf. You know, it may make sense. They have things on W Shop, you know, say 25 years in the making, and other places, you know. Maybe in the future, they will come out with a brand new um, DVD set just for him. Who knows? You know, maybe, maybe not. But that would be very nice. Now, some people think out there, once his contract expires from WWE, he might, might join AEW with his friend Christian. Maybe. I don't know if that's really going to happen or not. Who knows, you know? You know? So, you know? Or maybe that we will find a way to um, re-sign him. But I know he had enough. And he has some very good matches with a lot of these current wrestlers. And even the wrestlers are from back in the day, you know? Now, do you have a favorite match of all time? With Edge. You like when he became Mr. Money Bank. Twice. Became Radar Superstar. I love that gimmick. He has some great rivalries. Great matches over the years. Even with Christian. He has done it all. And I'm so glad he's in the Hall of Fame. Were you guys surprised. When he shocked the world. When he was in the Rumble. It was so obvious. Because he kind of. A hint that he's going to come back. But it's so obvious. I'm glad he 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 did a proper thing of retiring for the second time, you know. And I don't think he's gonna pull like a fake retirement speech like Mark Henry did a couple of years ago. Remember that? That was epic. Anywho, all the information down below. So actually, it doesn't matter if it's a random episode of SmackDown or a random episode of Raw or on. On pay per view, people will still tune in to watch this amazing performer. You know, he will definitely will be missed. 
maybe one day he will come back and visit the WWE Universe. Maybe. Maybe. If he's allowed to. But I think he will be. If he does not sign with another wrestling company. But I think he will be done done. You know. Anyway. So you guys check out this information. The article. If you guys and girls are very very curious. I'm going to sign off here. But before that. You guys and girls. To come follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok, all my social media accounts will be down, down below. Now, if you want to be part of the Robert Show, that's fine. Then, if not, don't worry about it. But hopefully, someone out there on YouTube will reach out to me. That'll be electrifying. We could discuss about random crap. Peace out, and I'll see you tonight sometime.